If you're on a weight loss journey right now, you probably know that you need to be eating more protein. But do you know why it's actually so important? Hi, if you're new here, my name is Amory Lawrence. I'm a nutrition specialist and weight loss expert that's helped transform the lives of over 1,500 women just last year. Just consider me your no BS fitness bestie. Now, last week we talked about why cutting carbs is actually making you gain weight. And this week we're gonna deep dive into protein. When I first started my health and fitness journey, it wasn't just knowing what to do, but why I was even doing that thing that helped me become a lot more consistent. It is exactly what helped my client Alex lose over 40 pounds and keep it off even two years later. So if you're struggling to lose weight and keep it off and you have no idea why it's so important for you to consume more protein, welcome to class. First and foremost, protein is the most satiating macronutrient, which means it's gonna keep you fuller for a longer period of time. And this is exactly why I'd prefer to add versus subtract foods when you have a craving. For instance, let's say that you're craving Oreos. Instead of just eating the Oreos, I'd actually recommend that you add a protein source to it. One of my favorite late night go-to snacks is Oreos topped over Greek yogurt. So good, super easy, and it keeps you satisfied for a longer period of time instead of feeling like you're constantly craving more because let's be honest when you're on a weight loss journey inevitably you are going to feel a little bit of hunger so by making sure that we're consuming enough protein we're nipping that hunger in the butt and preventing potential binging episodes now that's not to say that carbs and fats are not important because remember like we talked about last week carbs are super important for energy and fats are super important for hormonal support great hair skin and nails great digestion the list goes on this is why we want a healthy balance of both fats protein proteins, and carbohydrates in our daily diet. The next reason is because protein is the building block of muscle, which means it's gonna help you put on and retain lean muscle mass. Have you ever been on a weight loss journey before where you feel like you are working out consistently, you are dieting down, and it doesn't even look like you work out? This is because when you're in the gym, you are actually breaking muscle down. You are not building it up. The only way to rebuild that muscle mass is through consuming enough protein and rest and recovery. So not consuming enough protein could be one of the biggest reasons why you're not achieving that body recomposition, where you're able to lose fat and gain muscle mass. It's super important that we prioritize muscular growth because the more muscle you have, the easier it's gonna be to lose fat and keep it off. Also, if you're losing fat and not gaining any muscle mass, that is a quick way to get yourself a pancake ass. So if you're looking to lose weight, keep it off and create that toned look that you've been going for, make sure that you're prioritizing protein. Like and follow for more tips and I'll see you on the next one.